Well, from YouTube to your town, an Internet phenomenon makes a stop in Eugene. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Renee McCullough. And I'm Matt Templeman. The web has the power to make ordinary people into web celebrities, but one lady isn't stopping there. News Source 16's Jared Meyer is live in the newsroom tonight. And Jared, we can't recall seeing you so excited about a story in recent memory. Well, this is a lot of fun. Now, i got to tell you, Matt, a week ago, I'd never heard of Leslie Hall or the Gem Sweater Lady, as she is better known. But I discovered her like most people. Someone sent me an email saying, check this out on YouTube. Her video was hilarious, at least I thought so. But unlike other web celebs, she took her act on the road. And today we caught up with her bedazzled show. Take, check it out. This is a story about a journey inspired by gem sweaters powered by the web and involving everyday people. I think of my teeth. Okay, maybe not the last one. You could hardly call Leslie Hall every day. A small town girl from Iowa stumbled onto something very big and shiny. It's like total girl who's in love with herself dream come true. It started with a passion for jewel laden sweaters. Her website got huge. And then came the music. Her videos exploded onto the internet and into email inboxes loaded with gold pants and jewel sweaters. The hits rolled one after the other. How can I create more enthusiasm while I can wear fancy, fancy spandex suits at affordable prices? And I thought hip hop music would be a way into the unlocking the jewel heart. This is how we go. And while most internet stars rarely sparkle in the real world, Hall is a gem with staying power. She's made the rare leap from YouTube to your town. Don't blame me. We are like this new breed of internet fame. None of us know what to do with it, how to profit from it. Most people in viral video get famous by accident. Oregon certainly has its own web stars. How can we forget our favorite Portland zombie? What do you think? I like turtles. Or this woman, who was horrified to see her accident she had at work get posted across the web. Even I left a small mark on the YouTube community. You may remember a story I did a couple of years ago about cats learning to swim. Well, right now it's at 440,000 views and counting. I still have a long way to catch up with Gem Sweater Lady's biggest hits, who's proving she's more than just a one-sweater act. I'm not just like... I'm in spandex. Look at me, look at me, yeah. look at me, look at me. Hey, 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 hey. You know, I'm putting words down. I'll call me later, tell me if I really care. If you think that you know me, then prove it. And they're good. Her music is as tight as her outfits. She's on tour, and on Friday, the Iowa girl found a place that embraces her bejeweled style. You look like a typical person from Yeah, Iowa. yeah, no, totally. She is like, get up and go. Like, I love that you're downtown and shaking your groove thing. Want to try that with me? <laughs> <laughs> come on, come on. I got to pass on that one. <laughs> Others were already big fans. I stumbled across her video, the uh, This Way We Go Out, and I love it. It's really cool and very unique. One thing's for sure, Leslie Hall is not your typical gem and wasn't forged in the typical way. You think I would be like in Hollywood, like waiting tables? I mean, I would be back in Iowa working for my dad and selling garage doors. Instead, she's in Eugene, backup dancers in tow, and toes covered in glitter. The look made her famous online. Her show is making her famous in life. Hopefully they will see it in a twinkle. More lipstick, more eyeshadow. Put on that tight glittery top that doesn't fit so well. It looks good. And start dancing. Okay, Leslie has two CDs out with uh, her collection of songs, and you can find her collection of sweaters on her website. And if you like her stretchy outfits, well, thank her mom. Her mom made all of them. And, of course, you can see it all in person tonight. She's performing at John Henry's. The doors open at 6. The show starts at 7. Renee.